But in the meantime, I'll try and answer your question, Glenn, or you can give us your point. One of the two, welcome to you. Yeah, good afternoon, Dwayne. There's an open letter that's come from members of the Labor Party in Tasmania, the Liberal Party, the Greens, as well as Independents, and they're asking McLaughlin to do the right thing and to give Tasmania their own team without making the taxpayers spend $750 million to build a roof when no other team has to do that. These politicians are absolutely spot on. Tasmania deserves their own team. They do not need a new stadium. They need a team. They don't need a stadium. They need a team. Just like Adelaide and just like great Perth, to have you on, New South Wales. Yeah, great to have you on, Glenn. I know you've already called on this a number of times. I understand. How many times have you called on this one, Glenn, do you think? A few, but I agree with the politicians. You need to get the politicians on and ask them, yeah. why do we need to spend taxpayers' money on a stadium when <laughs> South Australia don't need to, WA, Queensland, New South Wales? Yeah, Glenn, we've been through, why, why, why we've been through this. Why you call, you get on, I'll, I'll let you... Yeah, you call, you get on. I'll let you on, obviously, and uh, I thought it might have been a different point. You might have had an update, but it's the same thing you've called about a number of times before. I believe that Tasmania, that Hobart does need a stadium with the roof. I believe they do need state-of-the-art facilities, uh, and we've seen the, the failure of what happened on the Gold Coast with not having state-of-the-art facilities for player attention. So it was a disaster from the start. So to me, I think you do need a stadium with a roof, I think the government, I think, is going to redevelop the area and spend a lot of money on redeveloping the area itself around where the stadium's going to be. So it won't be money specifically tied to the stadium. It'll be money in enhancing the area of, Taz of Hobart. That is going to be great for all those heading down there for a holiday and all those living in Tasmania to enjoy. And by the way, there's going to be a stadium there in that precinct as well. But any anyway, I appreciate your call again, Glenn. But... Um, it is great to have so many calls coming through on Tasmania. If we do have an update, we'll bring you that update from Gil. Anthony in South Morang, welcome to you, Anthony. Yes, 